here at Spooptober, we have, on occasion, some interesting, somewhat spoopy games. And I like to do something spoopy every Sunday of October. And today I have a collection of some interesting, weird little experiences that you may enjoy. They may frighten your pants. I guess we'll find out. Let's start with... Death Flush. Welcome to Death Flush. <laughs> oh, this is already awesome. <laughs> okay, so there's how to play the game. Got it. the Majora's Mask hand that made the cameo in Oracle of Ages. Vin, you have the perfect sound effect for this. Oh, I do. I'm aware of it. And I will play it. Are you okay? At the right time. Yep. Oh, I'm good. I'm, fine. I'm good, dog. It's just... I apostrophe TS. I just. I need to go to the bathroom. Why are you so like disturbed about this? Just do it. Aw, oh, baby, do you want me to go with you? No, it's okay. I must face this alone. Alone. This is usually my challenge, too. Look at this guy. Guy walks into the doctor's office. <laughs> well, not yet. We don't need to go in there just yet. It's bread. This mug makes me laugh. This FOV makes me sick. I never liked the taste of this stuff. It's always smart to keep one of these around. Oh boy, it's practically Christmas. <laughs> I like this TV program. Who takes an umbrella to the bathroom? I don't think the neighbors would like it if I took a pee in the hallway. This is my medicine. I only need it when I'm not well. Why do I need this stuff? I just need to pee. The Vindicator. Toilet seat killer executed. A reign of terror comes to an end. Oh, good. Well, now I don't have anything to worry about. It's, you know? I'm just delaying the inevitable chat. I'm sorry. I need to, uh, just uh, take a look. I'll oh, get in the shower real quick. This is one of those days where you poop so... poop that you need to take a shower right after. That's the kind of poop this is. No, oh, it's just a pee. Uh. 
I did it. Let's flush and get out of here. You know, the responsible thing to do would be to leave the toilet lid down. But no. Why is the lighting like this in the bathroom? What the hell? It won't open! Ronnie? Is something wrong? Help me! I'm trapped! It's going to be okay. It's just stuck. It's <laughs> probably swollen from the humidity. <laughs> that line is so good! And the delivery was perfect! There was like <laughs> a Troll 2 delivery. What was I thinking? I'll see if I can find a way to pry it open. Don't worry. Let's find Doc Strawberry. He always knows what to do. Alright, well, we should wash our hands first. Did you see that? Also, the game won't let me wash my hands. 0213. 5768745215621562. Toolbox here. It's got a rusty old lock on it. Beetlejuice's rusty old lock. It's gonna be a way to get it off. <laughs> Fuck. Did you see that? There was a, a figure. Pee pee poo poo scare man. Yeah, pretty much. Damn it. This congeli man is about. He's upon us. can only have one light on at a time. Time to take a cold shower? No, we don't want to do that. Rain opener. Vital item. If I could use this toolbox somehow, there's there should be a way to use the kite. Just an old bucket. Drain opener on the sink. I'll try. I 
I don't know if there's a specific button I need to use, but it's not happening. Oh, 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 okay. We got something. We got something. Ah, now we have a- whoa! Really powerful LL acid. It could eat through anything. <laughs> well, of course that's the solution. I was really proud of that solution, double entendre, no one- no one got it. A couple people did. <laughs> Fucking nerds. Oh! Wait, what? What's this doing in here? Note to self, in case you forgot, the answer is in your reflection, Ronnie. So it was, it was like zero, three, one, two. Zero, two, one, three. Oh, Grandpa? good. Grandpa? Grandpa Seth? Dude is keeping his grandpa's head in a safe. Is going in there to have a whiz, you little scum. What the fuck am I playing? You stay put right here, understand? <laughs> oh my god. I want a balloon that says fun. That's cool. I want a cold drink. You got any snacks? Uh. <gasps> Grandpa! Hey kid, why don't you have a seat? <laughs> oh my fucking god. Thank God for the bear. Oh, it's Doc Strawberry. Oh, Doc, you're always right. <laughs> what? Is this fucking WarioWare music? Medicine makes me feel good. Oh my god. No. You're dead. They killed you. Dying was step one, and now you're number two. Oh my god, that was a, that was a poop joke. Amazing. Ronnie? Did you say something? What's going on in there? This is getting scary. 
This is the best chit post I've played all year. Here's Johnny! We're being invaded by Peter Lorre! <laughs> what? Where's Ronnie? Here's Ronnie! Oh! Oh, Ronnie's dead. Can we, can we, like, just close the toilet? That's gross. I don't want to see that. Stay out of the bathroom! He can't get you if you're not in the bathroom! Oh, he's still alive. That was, like, the exact same effect as Chewie in, um, Last Jedi, uh, Last Starfighter Wars. Uh, Sky... The Rise of the Skywalkers. Holy shit! It looks like blood, but it burns like acid. I have to get it off somehow. <laughs> oh, that's better. We gotta figure something out. What could I do here? That... would... allow me to evade this blood. The umbrella! Rest room in peace. Why must I stand in all of these corners? Five, three, zero, four. Five. Three. Five. Three. Zero. Four. What are those floppy... What What are these floppy things? Oh, they're mouths. That's a tongue. Okay. Oh. That is... <sighs> Twitch, please do not ban. Let's do this thing. Sorry, who are you? Okay. Okay. Hey, stay with the group. Hey, 
Stay with the group. Stay with the group. Hey, hey, stay with the group. 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 <laughs> We're gonna make this sicko think twice about defiling the health and safety of our community. What's the plan, Ray? Fireworks. The good stuff. We're gonna scare the hell out of them. Don't you think we should wait until he finishes in the toilet? It's the right thing to do. Fuck that. It's go time. <laughs> oh my god. Huh. Nice. Uh -huh. Oh my god. Didn't have a chance. Hi, Lloyd. Do not fear me. This truly is a room of rest. Your destination is test a long way and this time. A beauty. It's text to speech like like Swedish or something, but <laughs> English words. <sighs> so good. Oh, it's it's French to English? Okay, good, good. Very nice. Eat twenty mints. Too late. What happens when you eat twenty of them? Where have I ended up now? Ronnie! Fresh breath, says chat. Good ending. Help! Sugar She's high. Gonna flush me. Who invited you? Asshole. Chat played the same trick on Joel. Oh, you guys are playing a trick on me. Oh, okay. Hang on! Ronnie! I'm coming! Your boyfriend is about to get the swirling of a lifetime. <laughs> Go flush yourself, weirdo! <laughs> Come get him! I'll wipe you Oh out. my god! Gotta shut that machine off and save Ronnie. The amount of, like, puns, double entendres, and wordplay in this game truly is astounding. Now what? Well, don't do that. That's weird. No, oh, what the fuck? Why'd you teleport, son? Time to leave? No. Oh, he teleports there when you- oh. Huh? That's weird. I'm trying to hit him. The axe is not making contact. Oh, now it is. Oh! 
there's a level of precision that must be employed here. Or luck. Hitboxes, more like shitboxes. I guess your career as a serial killer has open? gone down the drain. Romy, where are you? I guess your career as a serial. I said, I guess your career as a serial killer. Sorry. I'm still up here. I can't find a way to get down. What the hell? Oh, it's... Uh, oh, right. Oh, God. Oh, God. It was all just a dream. What now? An earthquake? The great mighty poo, and I'm going to throw my tish at you. We made it. You saved me. I love you, Ronaldo. Huh? Oh my god, it just keeps happening. Stay back. He had no power outside of the bathroom. <laughs> you can't escape me. I'm gonna make a dookie on your bones. Amazing. Yeah, that's definitely... That was perfect. Perfectly stupid. I love that. That's the kind of shit that I like seeing on my Sunday streams. Oh, God. All right. Next is Perfect Vermin. That was like an episode of Creep Show. Like a short story version. All right, so perfect vermin. Okay. Get that lo-fi look again. Okay. So it's seven days to die. Got it. Is there a point to me destroying everything? Because it was... Staplers cannot be destroyed. Stronger material than hammer. Oh, 
cool. Well, I like the um, physics of this and the aesthetic. Vin, look for things out of place. The fuck is this thing? I'm looking for anything, really. Just, just destroy a bunch of shit. The horror is that it's an office job. I guess no more horror than that. Oh! Is needed. Look for things out of place. I think I know what you're talking about now. So we're, we're looking for... ...living props, basically. It's- it's prop hunt. But their things are made of meat. Yeah, eat shit. Meat chair. Chat, we're made of meat. This whole time, we are meat. You know, we post the meat worm like it's a separate entity. Nope. Well, there's a thematic link here between the previous game and this one, at least. Clear. This bathroom was clear. <laughs> the switch came off. That's good. Let's see how we're doing on these couches. These couches do not pose a threat, but I'm destroying them anyway. All right, here. Definitely going to be something here that's a little, a little scummy. So somewhere there's something made of meat. Not that. No- whoa! Ah! Oh! Dude, Cronenberg would love this game. So if you want, uh, if you're wondering, this is actually the plot of Paul Blart Flesh Mall. It's similar to this. Turn to the elevator so you can try this again. Who, who, whomst are you? Whomst are youmst? Do it again, but better. Alright, can you, um... Can you get off my screen? Vinny, just look for things that are out of place, not everything. Alright, well, I still gotta bust the doors down, so... Oh, this is out of place, because it's... I get it. Like, but why would there be a chair in the kitchen? I see. Right, it's the same as before, but in general, I'm, I understand now. I thought I was looking for, like, blood... Or, like, say, a microwave that was slightly fucked up looking. No nonsense this time. Do your job. Everything 
Everything's normal here. Seems okay. Not okay. Vinny, there was a printer on the floor. Let's see. Everything's okay here so far. Hmm. Bean dip. Toilet paper on the wall? That's not toilet paper. One more thing. Chat, one more thing. Chair against the wall? I didn't see it. Fuck. Didn't check the fridge. Let's see. Try again. That chair- <clears throat> what? That was a normal chair. That was fine. Facing the wrong way? Mm, I guess so. Printer on floor. I thought I got that one. Middle room? Oh, it's just another chair. I like this guy. This is- he's got cool polyps. Return to the elevator. Huh. Conta there's contamination. He's fine. He's probably all right. <laughs> this floor's geometry has become uncooperative. Work quickly. Yes, it has. Printer on the floor is normal, I guess. Chair and couch. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Is this just the same as the first floor, but upside down? Oh my god, this guy does not see everything I see. Can you see what I see? The chair is there. It's on the fucking ceiling. Shoot it with your cock. Damn it. Oh, right, there was a fridge. I 
Someone said we have the same screen, Vin. However, we don't have the same brain. You know, you don't know where, like, my meat has been. I thought one of these was... no. One of these? No. Chair, again. Where's the chair? It's in the middle of, of where? In the chair? Oh, this chair, right. I just, for some reason, like, yeah, it just doesn't register. Just go. Did this guy. This fucking guy. Please. Why are there two screen- what? The fuck? The fuck? The ever-living fuck? What? The fuck? Okay, well, we'll start with this one. Wasn't the couch. It's just the same levels. Yeah. Different versions of challenges. Okay. I oh, got that. Where's the floor printer? Let's see it. Okay. Three remaining. Uh. Toilet. Can't be having the toilet. Uh, not like that. Not there. Two left. Yeah, there's some new stuff here. It's it's not the entire um, exact same thing. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Fuck! Everything here's okay. God damn it. One, two, on, I'm on the left screen right now, obviously. Two. Nothing here. There should be five, maybe? Fridge. And there should be maybe one more here. I don't see it, mate. The bathroom. I don't know what what did I miss in the bathroom on the left. Oh, another toilet. God. God damn it. Okay. Don't have much time. Don't really have any time left. Chair on the left screen. Too late. Yeah, I don't really like this. Uh, not anymore. Chair. Is it just... It looks like it's mostly chairs on this screen. One, two. I'll do this one a lot faster this time. 
three, four. So that's four over here. There should be one more. Bathroom, five. Okay, right screen. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay, good. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Stanley knew he had to escape the office. I can't even read what this dude is saying right now, chat. As much as I would love to. Escaped? Oh, come- oh no, there's no way this is happening. It was good to live. It was good. If only I had more time. The flesh mall must be defeated. <laughs> It's all just a dream. That's it. Doctor! Doctor, my brain hurts! Mr. Schwitz, please sit down. We need to discuss your test results. There's been an accident, a massacre downtown. It... that will have to wait. This will wait. There are people dying. You are dying. It's what we had feared. Cancer has spread. It's now... <laughs> Pancreas alone, it would be inoperable. It spreads your liver, your lungs, and even your bones. Oh no. Four to six months? With bone cancer? Oof. Even the word cancer just fucking sucks. What a bummer. What was the last line, chat? I think I missed the last line. I did miss the last line. What did it say? No one will care about my death if no one knew I ever lived. Jesus Christ. Well, that was a different kind of Spooptober game. And, uh, very disturbing it was. Let's do maybe one or two more. If I can still get to the Sage games, I'd be happy. But there's a, a game called Virtual Open House. Where, it's like a chill game where you just go check out open houses. That's it.
Hello there, my name is Agent Name, and I'm one of your local North Tree real estate agents for client neighborhood area. Nice to meet you. Thank you for being a part of our alpha testing program. We're excited about our partnership with Optics Dynamics Labs to help bring you the latest in cutting edge real estate technology through nano drones, photogrammetry and industry leading machine learning. But what does this all mean? Well, client name, I'm glad you asked. For the first time ever, we've made the home buying process more convenient by bringing the full open house experience to the comforts of your own personal digital devices. It's home buying revolutionized for the 21st century. Through a combination of camera drones and thousands of still images, we can now scan and recreate fully explorable three-dimensional snapshot of any home. For a seller, that means no more dealing with the inconvenience of multiple showings. For a buyer, you can now browse our entire portfolio while sitting on your couch. This is actually really convenient technology. We're excited to show you the perfect home in your client neighborhood area. It's a fresh listing from one of our newer developments. But before we can get all to that fun stuff, I'll need you to go. I need you to go. I need you to go. I need you to go. So there's um, turning and moving. Okay, I think we're ready to get started. I highly suggest that you wear headphones to get the full virtual open house experience. Please keep all hands and feet inside the ride at all times and remember to have fun. And do let us know if there's anything we can do to improve your experience because here at North Tree Real Estate, you, client name, are our highest priority. It would be something like this, wouldn't it? This is a unity house. I just need to smash the toilet. Oh my god. $285,000 for a house that size. Do you know how much that would cost in New York? <laughs> The answer is no, is how much that would cost in New York. No, it would... It, someone said those don't exist in New York. No, they do. Staten Island, Brooklyn has houses like that. I mean, anywhere outside of the city, of course, but, I mean, Staten Island's part of the city, technically. But a house like that, I would say 650 double why is there a shovel in the backyard oh for yard work two car garages plenty of room for storage could be converted into that perfect personal space you've always wanted The dining room is a perfect entertaining space with clear sight lines of the backyard and living room, as well as easy access to the kitchen. You see him in the reflection? Yeah, that is a weird thing going on in the reflection. I can click the shovel. Nope. 
Yep, we can go upstairs. Just checking out this cool house. Yep, definitely a cool house. Oh, cool, what's that? I like that thing. That's nice. This is good photogrammetry. Marble counters and tiling add a sense of luxury that helps you to unwind and relax after a long day. Sorry about the scratch. I had, an, I had an itch. I sometimes forget that I have a microphone right next to my face. Don't look at it. Oh, so, uh, okay, there's, there's a couple objects remaining. The second floor bedroom is perfect for a smaller child or a home office for when you really need to get work done. <laughs> is that for Steve from Blue's Clues? A second floor laundry room means no more hauling heavy loads of clothes up and down the stairs. Talk about real time saver. Another completely redone and modern full bathroom means never having to fight over who gets to use the shower first. Awesome. This in this bedroom uh, uh, bathroom, you can get pulped. And I like saying pulped because it's awesome. This end hall bedroom is large enough for two small children or that moody teenager who enjoys their privacy and loud music. This is my bedroom now! I wanna- I wanna live in this particular bedroom! Scratch. Tucker, you're getting the small room. No, I want the- I want the bigger one! I want a bunk bed! Tucker, you're an only child. I want a bunk bed! By the way, that's based on a true story. That's based on my actual real life. I was a Tucker. Yeah, well, yeah. I don't know. I just thought they were cool, because, like, you could, like, sleep on the top bunk and shit, and it would be cool up there, and then you could, like, you know, the bottom bunk could be, like, a fort. Like, at night. <laughs> Loft bed? Bed? I didn't know that when I was a kid. So, if anyone's played this before, does anyone know where the last object is? Just so we can, you know, move things along a little bit there. The shovel outside. Door opened to the outside. Did it? Front door, maybe. Oh, okay. Front door is open. No, can't go that way. Guest bathroom is behind you. Oh, oh, oh.
Oh, I um. I, I can't get informations anymore. <laughs> That's good. I, I like this guy. That's good. Uh, current scan has encountered a memory error recompiling data from an earlier restore point. Um, approximately one hour ago. Unity. <laughs> Oh, fuck. Someone was running with a jelly sandwich. Saw that dude in the closet. <laughs> okay. Hi, <laughs> spooky horror demon. Oh, this is so cool. Yeah, that was the ground beef squinjili man. I saw it. I saw the ground beef. Real date and time. Oh fuck, it is the real date and time. inside. Do games like this actually spook you at all? A little bit. Not, not too much. Phasmophobia is probably the most recent example of a game that got me, like, good. Yeah, it's just a creepy, cool concept that's kind of funny a little bit. But, I like it. Soma got me. There's- listen. I'm not afraid to admit that some games scare the fuck out of me. But, it's just, uh... It's gotta be more than cheap jump scares. But, yeah. Phasmophobia, like VR horror, absolutely... Absolutely gets me. If it's done well. Cause that's, you know, your, your senses are engaged. Master bedroom that was upstairs. Soma is a game made by the Amnesia developers. Oh, this is the master bedroom. And, uh, it's more story-based and, like, just... It's a conceptually mindfuck type game. I didn't, that wasn't a good sentence, but you know what I mean. Welcome home. <laughs> oh. Really good existential dread from Soma. And some decent, like, scares and, you know, stuff that can surprise you a little bit. Cool shining hallway.
System unassigned reference. <laughs> Come on. So what's happening now? Spawn system spawn it character. Damn it. Look at the numbers. I, I'm looking. I mean, I guess I have to just... Let the time run out. Oh boy. Not time position. Oh, you're right. <laughs> All right, we're inside the ground beef man's brain. This is good. I kind of feel like I'm playing Worlds. Someone's meat room that they made in 1998. Well, you know what? I like this house, so I'm going to make an offer. <laughs> no more than $350,000. But I want it. I'm in. anyone's window open how did it know my name I never typed it in it's my PC name <laughs> uh, you know what I would say to that chat <laughs>